Here we are then folks, Land Rover Defender. Now we all know a little bit about these, don't we? 300 TDI this one, best of the lot in my eyes. Virtually no electronics to go wrong and let you down. Good for oh, four, 500,000 miles without too much drama, aren't they? They're fantastic, aren't they? Brilliant, that's why the army still use them, don't they? So there you go. This one started off, or the bulkhead started off white. I don't know what colour the Land Rover started off, to be honest. But that bit there, let's assume it's the right one, started off as a white one. Now in willow green, as you can see. No nastiness in the in the uh, engine compartment there. Uh, it um, It's all nice and smart and tidy and as it should be. I've been up the road in it uh, and it pulls really nicely, actually. It goes very well, dries really well. A uh, little bit of a whiny diff, I think, maybe, something like that. I only went up the industrial estate, if I'm honest, uh, but um, it seemed to go trundle along lovely. Nice set of wolf wheels, as you can see. Some good Goodyear Wrangler tyres. Uh, Chassis-wise, wax oiled up a long time ago by the looks of it. Uh, keeping, uh, keeping the dreaded tin worm at bay. It's uh, a couple of running uh, side steps there, running board side steps, call it what you like. Interior is lovely and clean. New new uh, seat covers by the looks of it. Uh, and um, some good seats, upgraded seats, I would think. Uh, nice headlining, etc. Carpeted out in the rear. Dashboard is nice and smart and tidy. 200,000 miles showing. Removable steering wheel. You can take that off for security. Uh, so uh, that's that. As I say, it runs along really nice. Um, good coat of paint on it i don't know when that was done in all fairness but anyway it's a good coat of paint uh chassis in there look she's had a repair down the bottom of there the rest of it looks good and of course she's had a rear cross member there uh with extensions which is good so that's that job sorted out isn't it uh so uh, there you go around the back end uh, uh, uh obviously tow bar etc back door really good she's obviously been reskinned. Uh, interior cover and all the rest of it nice load liner and mats and all the rest of it in the back few bits and pieces if you wish to put them on checker plate kit for the top of the front wings in fact there's, there's more or less a checker plate kit in here look bonnet rear corners there's a grill and and some headlamps around original steering wheel should you wish to go back to that uh but lovely in there spot on so all good to be honest when it came down the road um, I thought it was TDCI coming down. It, uh, uh, it obviously later colour and all the rest of it. So, uh, so there you go. Again, in there, really nice and smart and tidy. Door cards are as new, if they're not new by the looks of them. Again, doors in good order, no bother. So, there you go. You best nip down and have a bit better look round it, haven't you? But it certainly looks a good old Land Rover to me let's not forget it is a 1997 or 8 she's getting on in it uh, but um, it certainly doesn't look as though it's had hard life that is for sure it looks a very very clean straight proper little defender so there you go nip down have a look five former keepers on the V5 uh, a, a small wedge of invoices um, from from all sorts of things from trim uh, to um, plastics all sorts of bits and pieces in there come down have a peruse through uh, but uh, yeah it certainly looks a real genuine and it looks a lot newer than it actually is little defender thank you